it's hard to put on this costume without help. But then again, Jean Lambert Wilde is trying to don an armor made entirely out of porcelain. The actor and director is playing King Richard III in a stage production of the Shakespeare play in Limoges, central France. And when it came time to design the costumes, he immediately turned to the city's most celebrated material. There's nothing more beautiful for a clown like myself than having something so beautiful, so fragile, so shiny and so hard, all at the same time. And it's always interesting when working in a place like this, to draw from the resources of the land. The armor is made up of seven pieces that took seven months to complete. The meticulous work was done in this porcelain factory, spearheaded by Christian Couty. The artist says it was a big technical challenge, since porcelain slowly retracts during the heating process. It gets 13.5% smaller, so we had to mold it to Jean Lambert Wilde. We molded it to parts of his body and then we enlarged the molding. From there, I worked on each individual piece that makes up the armor. Several molds and adjustments later, the pieces are sculpted by hand. Once completed, the armor is painted in Limoges' trademark blue and handed off to the costume designers at the theater. The next step, figuring out the best way to attach the armor to the actor's body. It's not easy. For some of them, you can't use a machine at all. The first armor was completed just in time for the opening of the play, and a second one is ready, just in case. Shakespeare fans can catch Richard III in his porcelain suit until January 29th in Limoges, before it goes off on tour in Europe.